What's up everyone, this is All I Talk Is Tech, and today I'm going to show you this amazing glitch that'll totally glitch out your iPhone and make it freeze. Let's get started. Okay, so huge thanks to Everything Apple Pro. He is the one who showed this to everyone first. He's an amazing YouTuber. Go subscribe to him. So I'll have his channel link down below, but click on the link down below in the description. It's going to take you to this website. Now just tap on the word this. Now this was discovered by Everything Apple Pro. Go sub to him. So go ahead and tap on more. Tap on add to iCloud Drive, and then go ahead and tap on iCloud Drive again. Now from here, you want to go and open up the app iCloud Drive. Now if you don't know where it is, it's under iCloud Settings if you don't know where it is. But go ahead and tap on that file and tap on Share. And then go ahead and send it as a text message. Now this is just a huge line of code, pretty much just gibberish. And it's an emoji that's supposed to make up another emoji, but your phone glitches out. But basically it's going to take you to this screen and you want to go ahead and type in the contact or your victim. And then you want to go ahead and send that message, and it's going to take forever. You may have a blank screen. Just wait it out. It's going to take, like, probably two minutes. But once your victim does receive this message, instantly their iPad or iPhone will just be destroyed. They can't use it. They can't do any buttons. They can't scroll. They can't do anything. So I'm going to go ahead and try to fix this on my iPad. As you can see, in order to fully fix this, what you have to do is hold down the home and the power button at the same time, and you'll get it to restart. Now, if you have an iPhone 7, hold down the power and the volume down or up button, I'm not sure. But in order to fully fix this, you wanna go inside the message settings, make sure it's set to 30 days, so that way after 30 days, it'll delete all your messages, and then go ahead and set the time zone to whatever time zone it is, but make sure it's set automatically off. You want to scroll ahead 30 days ahead, and then that'll delete all messages from 30 days. So you want to make sure all your iMessage is delete, and that is the only way to fix your iPad, or else iMessage will never open up again on your iPhone without glitching out. Anyways, that's going to be about it today. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, peace.